Good afternoon. Today we're going to be setting up an online walkthrough on how to set up a new chapter for online e-registration in the Virginia Forensic Leagues. This applies to all leagues, Swavafel, Novafel, Zenvafel, Shenvafel, and every other Vafel. Online registration is real simple and it takes a little bit to start up but it's going to be well worth your while. Let's go to the best place to start which is of course online at the vanfl.org website. It stands for Virginia NFL. Virginia NFL is the overarching organization that takes care of all Virginia Forensic Leagues. There's several ways to sign up to create a chapter. You could go to the bar here and it says Virginia Forensic Leagues and we see all the various areas where we set up one no matter what chapter you compete in or district you compete in you can you're a member of Virginia Forensic League and you can of course join uh, and compete at any uh, of the uh, various leagues in Virginia that's why we call it Virginia Forensic Leagues all right creating an online chapter it says click on the icon to the right to go to the tabroom.com this is our program that we use uh, through uh, uh, the uh, generosity of uh, Chris Palmer in uh, Massachusetts, a good friend of mine. You uh, scroll down the league to register to the Virginia Forensic League. Okay. And you click register. Piece of cake. And we see here, uh, let's, uh, let's log out and let's start uh, again create a new account all right let's start with our first name uh, my first uh, let's use uh, my first name Bruce uh, Greg and my email address I'll just put it down as debatezar at gmail.com my phone number I'll use the school number doesn't matter the format although we really prefer to have your cell phone number. My password in this case should be um, uh, sample and then you repeat it. Alright, we're creating the accounts. The first step should be confirm your contact information below. Alright, we'll put this in here as the school contact information. and I'll say that's my cell even though it's not. We should always put your cells down uh, so we can contact you in case there's any changes. Okay. So that looks good. Yes. I'm good to go. Now, what do I do next? Well, let's uh, let's go to register, create a chapter. Okay, so school name. Let's call it uh, Sample High School and in Virginia. Save the chapter. And let's have uh, view the roster. That's the first step you have to do is you have to create your roster. So let's add some students. Uh, let's add Johnny on the spot. He's a great kid we don't worry about phonetic pronunciation and he's going to graduate in 2011 and he's a male do you have to click male or female not really some tournaments uh, in the Northeast that this is designed for have housing we don't really have housing for midweek tournaments although we may have housing for states uh, and let's go for uh, Fred uh, Wonder Lizard um, an amazing interpreter and let's say he's graduating there and I've got too many boys on the list so I think I'd better worry about adding some girls uh, Olga uh, Olga Stein uh, and I better uh, make sure that they know how to pronounce it Olga Stein Olga Stein Stein and Olga is graduating this year All right. 
You don't have to put a lot of the information in, although we do prefer it for Project 1200. So you could end up with just uh, Fritz Wonder, Pige Wonder Pigeon. And you could just add Fritz that way without putting anything in. All right, so now I can always edit some of these students. Say I wanted to, uh, oops, Fritz, where did Fritz go? I don't see Fritz. Well, let's find out. You return to chapter, and let's view the roster again. Apparently, you do have to put in his graduation year. How nice. Fritz D. Wonder Pigeon. And he's graduating in 2011. Let's see if we're good to go. Yes, good enough. Now, let's say in our uh, listing we want to change something. I often get names as names incorrect as is. So Olga, I discovered it was not Olga, but Angie. Oh no. So I change the name, I go in, I review it, and then I change the name. This will uh, occur uh, when you uh, print up your uh, rosters. This will occur all the time. Now, let's say Fritz, uh, Fred Wonder Lizard, who's uh, graduating in, 2000, in 2010, we have a slight problem with uh, Fred Wonder Lizard. Fred Wonder Lizard uh, decided that he was no longer going to do debate. And you really don't want to see his name ever, ever again. So you simply retire Fred, Fred Wonder Lizard. Click there, and his name has now disappeared. Be very careful on retiring students. They may come back, but uh, no real issue. All right. So when we're done with this, we return to the chapter. And we are set. So the next documentary that we'll be covering will be how to register for a Waffle tournament online. And uh, it should be pretty exciting. Uh, we hope that uh, this uh, video presentation has helped you in uh, preparing for registering for the Virginia Forensic League tournaments.